What's up everybody? Well, I'm back with a Goodwill haul. We went to a Goodwill bin and I'll show you what I got. But I have to tell you some stuff that I can't get in a video. Now, when you go to a Goodwill bin, it's all paid by the weight of what you have. Clothes and shoes go in the same thing and you pay by the weight. Just like house stuff goes in a different cart and you're going to pay that different because there are two different things and you pay two different times. Alright, the first thing was, I find this mountain bike sign. I had to get it because I like to do biking. Now, something I forgot to put in here to show you in the video is the sleeves that keep you warm if you wear a bike jersey and you need warm arms. They're made by Trek. They were brand new and I found them. So I got them as well. But then I find this Cannondale saddle and I got a couple of bikes that need some nice seats and I saw this so I had to pick it up. Now you know I go and sometimes I find cameras and tripods. Well, I find this Sunpack Pro 523P tripod. It's missing the plate but you can always buy them on Amazon. So I got it anyway because it's a nice tripod. Now people say, what do I do with all these tripods? I do a lot of things and I'm working on doing a film. So I'm trying to get tripods to put them in each place so I have different views. Now with the tripod, it was in this bag. It's a vintage bag and it says cylinder regulator assembly. It's an old vintage bag and I thought heck I'll keep the bag and put tripods in it like that one was but I'll put a tripod in it that fits it. Now when I say I look for cameras and tripods sometimes I find ones that aren't even worth buying but I get them anyway because they have stuff with them. This is a Kodak camera. It is a Kodak 2730 Easy Share. Now I have another one, but the reason why I got this was it came with an SD card. And I had a camera coming and I needed an SD card, so I said why not? I'll use it and I have a charger for this, so I'm going to see if it works. Now the second camera I find is old and vintage. It is a Kodak Instamatic 20. You open the door like this in the back, put the film in, you use this to do that, and then the red button takes the picture. Now I got this just because I'm going to be putting a shelf behind me, and I wanted some old cameras. So I have a couple, now this just adds to it. Now I'm a guy. Every time I go to a Goodwill or the Goodwill bin, if I see nuts and bolts, I grab them. I'm hoping these, these are them things that go into wood that is threaded so it stays there. I'm hoping these fits my tripod so I can fix a couple things. Now I want to talk about the things that weren't in the video. I've got a fishing jacket with a pad that sits on the bottom. So if I go somewhere and I want to sit down, I have a pad with it. Now what else I got was two backpacks for camping. They're the ones with the metal frame and hold a lot of things. I find two of them, one for my wife and one for me. I have one already, but the one I got today had more pockets and had more stuff that I can put in it. Had room for everything. My wife's is the same size and she got stuff. And a couple things that was in her bag were brand new in the wrapper. Water package to put water in with the filter. And then there's ear bags in there for pillows. That's a good find there because they were brand new. Now I find two other things. This is crowd cut removable viners. So it's vinyl that you can peel back off. Now what I did is I make a couple of these because people want to put a decal on their windows, but they don't want them all the time. So I make them removable ones, that way they can take it off without having any kind of glue stuck. 
and I find a brand new Black & Decker glue gun. This is marked for $12.88 on sale at Marshalls, or I don't know, Marshalls, but there's a T in there. I don't know what that means, but anyway, it's brand new. You know, and I have two nice ones, but this is brand new, and yes, I'm going to be using it. So now, I got these two candle holders, but now, see, glue guns, I can paint these flat black, drip the glue down, and make them look gothic-like for Halloween. I thought, they already have these right here. I can paint these different to make them look like something else. But I'm going to paint these. And I'm going to show you when I do it, I'll make a video of me doing it. Now what I'm about to show you is something I saw walking to the bin. I seen it in a window in the bin. I was like, is that what I think it is? I had to go in and grab it. This is what I find. 1982 Tamaya Wild Willies. This is the original from 1982. The wires, this, the springs. Now it's a little beat up. It's broken. But all the servos are there and the tires are there. This is the OG of 1982. This even moves, so when you tilt it, the springs, and everything is there, even the rubber on the shocks. They're still there. It's bent up a little bit, but I'll buy a new body and restore it to make it look nice. Being the arms missing, this is supposed to be straight. There's a piece missing here. The wheel's missing. The gas tank's missing. The front thing's missing. And the grill's missing. But I'll restore this and hopefully make it look a little nicer. Well, I hope you all like my Goodwill hauls. And when I buy stuff at the Goodwill, I don't always buy used. But I like going just to see what I can find. Who doesn't like just going to be an adventure and looking for something that you don't have? Oh, I forgot. I found a bike light. And it goes to my other battery. So now I have another light. It's made by Bright Eyes. It's probably not expensive, but it works and it is nice. Well, this is going to be the end of the video and that's my haul. And again, I hope you like the videos I do from my Goodwill things and my Goodwill hauls. So again, thank you for watching. This is Whatever Robert. Whatever you do, go thrift shopping and have fun.